Why do casino table games have maximum bets? In my last video, I answered why they have minimum bets, but this is a little bit more complicated. I was playing blackjack with a friend of mine, and he was going on a bit of a run, and he was betting $25 a hand, and next thing you know, he slaps down a $1,000 bet, and the dealer points to the sign and says, sorry, it's a $500 max. And he said, why wouldn't you take my bet? You guys have the same house edge. It's not like all of a sudden I have the advantage because I'm betting more, and they just said, sorry, that's the rules. Well, the reason why those are the rules is for a few reasons. One, the casinos like to know what their exposure is at any given point in time. So they can look at any pit and they know what the minimum and maximum bets are, and they know that somebody's not gonna throw down a $50,000 bet and they are gonna be caught off guard. Casinos have strict rules about how much cash they need to keep on reserves to make sure that they can pay people who win. With them being able to know how much people can bet it allows them to understand what their maximum exposure is at any given point in time. The other reason is that dealing is just like any profession. The more experience you have, the more responsibility you're given. The best dealers in the casino are the ones who deal at the highest limits. That's because they can deal the fastest, they know what to look for uh, on behalf of the casino, and they also know how to make it an enjoyable experience for some high rollers. Well, you don't want somebody who's used to dealing a $5 blackjack game all of a sudden taking a $50,000 bet. Dealers are humans. They make mistakes too. And if you are a new dealer, they much rather you make a mistake on a $5 bet than a $50,000 bet. It's all about casinos having control, knowing what their exposure is. And this way, you have the answer if anyone ever asks you the question,